All right, here we go. First launch of Carlos's new boat, 2023 Minecraft, 20 foot with the Suzuki 140. Brand new boat. We're gonna take her out. We're gonna do a break in on it. Make sure everything's dialed in. We'll get you out on the water. started the break-in process we had to do um, a little bit here because when they installed this bulb they installed it horizontal there was no prime on the fuel filter housing yet so we had to take all the zip ties loose lift the bulb up kind of hold it um, vertically prime that fuel and now we're just giving it its first five minutes of um, heat up putting some heat in the engine and then we're going to uh, proceed with the rest of the break-in procedure all right this is my friend carlos hey hi carlos hi we're out testing his new boat um, we just started the break-in period uh, did the five minutes of warming up and now we're going to be just idling around for 15 minutes and then we'll do uh, one hour, 45 minutes at 3000 RPM. Uh, pretty nice little boat. We found a couple little issues here and there, but I've been helping them out, uh, getting them straightened out. We just turned on the live well. And uh, I'm going to show you this because it's funny. This is the kind of stuff you expect when you get a new boat. Uh, so we turn the live well on and... Oh, I closed the valve. Let me see here. Sorry, it's worth it. This is funny. So from the factory, they hooked it up backwards. <laughs> so the, the water's pumping out of the overflow drain instead of coming out of the spout. So we'll have to fix that, but we already dealt with the fuel filter, like I said. Overall, pretty nice boat. We haven't turned on this GPS. Let's turn this on. We hooked this up, installed it the other day. Also, put a marine radio in. Turn this fish finder on. See if we're marking any fishies down there. But yeah, we're on a timer for everything that we do. We'll cruise around just like we are for 15 minutes. It's really nice out. The water's really clear. You can see the bottom down there. We're in about, I'd say 25 feet right now. Yeah, I brought him some jigs. So once we get done with this break-in procedure, these were working really good yesterday. We're going to go out and do a little jigging. Catch a fish? <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> All right, so stick with us. Right, it's beautiful out here. Got a little cloud coverage, protect us from the sun. We did our 15 minutes. So now we're going to put this... Uh, boat to the test 3000 rpm for an hour and 45 minutes we're going to see what speed it does at 3000 rpm as well got speed on our fish finder there so here we go we're doing 3000 rpm going about eight and a half nine mile an hour so we're just going to be cruising around for an hour 45 minutes Put the radio up there, nice up high, keeps it out of the way, really a clean little boat. Just cruising along, 3000 RPM, she's running like a dream, nice and smooth, going along the coast here of Aguala. We could probably go all the way out to the island today because we still got another hour. 
3,000 RPM and then we got to do an hour at 4,000 RPM. Beautiful out here though. No swell, no wind. All right, we're getting close to this Echeo. Uh, we're at one hour, 44 minutes. So we're ready to switch up to 4,000 RPM. She's been running good. No lights have come on for temperature or oil or anything. Uh, everything seems to be working fine. I'll kick it up to 4,000 RPM for an hour and see how it goes. completed we got a full hour in at 4,000 rpm uh, we stopped along a little grass patch here did a little jigging caught a barracuda cut it up for some strip bait and we're just pulling a couple strip baits because there's some birds around here I'm gonna see if we can hook up on a mahi um, if we do we'll turn the camera on so stick around back we put about close to seven hours on the boat we're just uh, out here in front of it and going I dropped the jig a couple times we trolled around some uh, weed lines picked up a couple peanut mahi a couple uh, Almaco jacks but that was it breaking's almost done he's just got to run the boat for three more hours speed so running really good no problems 